Well, generally speaking, the Phantom 3 is very well built. I'm very pleased with it. But the controller, one spot here on the controller is not so well. It, it moves around. Now, the controller for the Inspire 1 isn't like that. It, it's rock solid. So it's disappointing. And then by the time you get like an iPad mini on top of the controller, I mean, it's just like flopping around. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some hot glue in here to stabilize it and I'll let you know how it works. Okay, so I went ahead and glued it and it doesn't look real pretty, but it's much more stable. I don't really know how long it'll last, um, but you know, if something did go wrong, I know from in the past, it would be very easy just to use a razor blade and to cut through the glue and peel it off. Uh, but it should, you know, I think that it'll, it'll really help uh, to provide the stability that I'm looking for. So when I put the iPad mini back on here, so now when I move around, um, it just feels better. I'm not sure that it's as good as the Inspire, which is just really rock solid, but uh, it's clearly much better. Now, what I was using is I have a glue gun, and you can get these at any hardware store, and uh, you get the little glue sticks, and um, they're pretty inexpensive, and it's pretty easy to use. Just make sure you don't forget to unplug it, uh, or you could uh, that could be a problem. But I think this is something I'd recommend, is to, um, is to go ahead and help to firm up this area. And another thing that I was noticing that it would do is, not only is the whole thing rocking, but the thumb screw itself would become loose, and I would constantly be tightening it every time I wanted to use it. So I think the glue is a good idea. Yeah.